Air Force C-17s delivering relief to Beirut following deadly explosion. U.S. forces are working to bring aid to the people of Beirut, Lebanon, after a port explosion killed at least 135 and wounded about 5,000 more. The U.S. is actively engaged in delivering food, water, and medical supplies to the Lebanese armed forces to meet the critical needs of the Lebanese people," said General Frank McKenzie, commander of U.S. Central Command, in a statement. An Air Force C-17 Globemaster III was the first to make a humanitarian aid delivery to Lebanon today, CENTCOM reported. Piloted by members of the 816th Air Expeditionary Airlift Squadron, the flight delivered 11 pallets of food, water, and medical supplies out of Al Udeed Air Base in Qatar. Two more C-17s are expected to bring more supplies sometime in the next day. The Lebanese government declared a two-week state of emergency, blaming the explosion on 2,750 tons of ammonium nitrate that were improperly stored in a warehouse for six years, the BBC reported. We are closely coordinating with the Lebanon Armed Forces and expect that we will continue to provide additional assistance throughout Lebanon's recovery effort," Mackenzie said. CENTCOM officials did not immediately respond to questions about other efforts the command is making in response to the unfolding tragedy in Lebanon or what the command's tactical and strategic concerns are given its location in the CENTCOM area of responsibility. U.S. forces are working to bring aid to the people of Beirut, Lebanon, after a port explosion killed at least 135 and wounded about 5,000 more. 